we've seen the biggest improvements in getting dementia diagnosis rates up from under 50% to two thirds. I think we've also made great improvements in terms of reducing antipsychotic prescribing in the last five years by reducing by half uh, and improving hopefully support and information sources for families living with dementia. For me, I think the biggest impact would be recognising dementia as a long-term condition rather than a specialist mental health or neurological illness. If that was the case, then we could actually put many of the things that GP, many of the skills that GPs use into practice by getting them to recognise that it's a chronic illness rather than a specialist neurological condition. I think the things I found inspiring were actually the session on prevention and risk reduction. It's quite intriguing to think that only five years ago we didn't really think about preventing or reducing someone's risk of dementia. And that information has come from long-standing research evidence that shows that the number of people with dementia now is actually much less than was predicted 20 years ago. So I think the concept that we might be able to reduce the future numbers with dementia, even if we don't find any magic new tablets or cures, is actually one of the biggest breakthrough knowledges in research in the last decade.